so you capture them in liquid and then you collect them and then you dry them and you weigh them? No, it's like them. a formula. Tuberculosis has got that very waxy surface or cell envelope that protects the bacterium pretty much from any toxic compound or host immune response that tries to you know, block it um, and kill it. So one of the major difficulties is to, to get antibiotics to cross uh, this envelope to reach its targets that are usually inside the bacterium. So we have to come up with different um, compounds, different chemistries um, that are able to, to achieve this result and kill the bacterium. And what about the purification of the proteins that you're doing with Vicky? Have yeah, got any I think uh, we have the cells ready to go. Yeah, we have the cells ready in Minar uh, 80. What we're trying to do is really to understand how the bacterium works. What does it need to survive, to multiply, to thrive in a host when, when it infects? So our main interest is in working on this cell envelope, how it is made. We know that these lipids are made in the inside of the bacterium and then they have to be transported to the cell envelope where they are going to contribute to this waxy surface. And the transporter, if you will, required to take them from the inside to the outside of the bacterium had been missing for over uh, 30 years. Yes, people have been working on these lipids for more than 30 years now. And recently uh, we discovered the nature of this transporter, we discovered it. And we also discovered some small inhibitors that are capable of blocking the transport function of this transporter. So that the lipids remain stuck on the inside, if you will, can't reach the outside, and that kills the bacteria. The activity uh, on units per gram of cells or milligram of dry cells. Okay. Because what we are hoping uh, is that we're going to be able to develop some new antibiotic based on this strategy. So what we're doing now is to explore uh, more thoroughly how this transporter works so that we can optimize some molecules that are going to block it even more effectively uh, and that are going to penetrate the inside of the bacterium even more effectively to reach this transporter and block it. My background is in genetics of this bacteria. I was always fascinated with antibiotics. Um, just because I think, you know, as a kid I was finding it so marvelous. You had fever, you were not feeling well, uh, your mom was giving you this and then within a couple of days, that's it, the fever's gone and I found it so magic that, you know, I wanted to be part of that and work on something that had to do with infectious diseases and, and treatments. I really want to, you know, try and make a difference in this way. If I, you know, one of the projects we're working on, one of the targets we're working on, like this transporter, could eventually one day lead to um, bringing a new antibiotic to the market that would treat people and prevent all those uh, fatalities, um, I would really be happy. That's really my motivation.